Project 007 is the upcoming James Bond title, and it's pretty much, guys, a very anticipated title. I know it's very high on my most anticipated list, just because, guys, it's James Bond, obviously growing up, playing, you know, the old James Bond titles, even back on the Nintendo 64, had some really amazing fun with GoldenEye and a number of, uh, of these titles. I want to talk, guys, about this new iteration. This has been a title, guys, that I've been very excited about, obviously, been really wanting another James Bond title. Obviously, guys, we've got IO Interactive, or the ones that are working on this, obviously, they have a lot of experience in games kind of like this, like spy-type style games, and what I will say is, is this one could be something really special. And so in this segment of the show, I want to talk about everything that we want out of Project 007, and when I say we, guys, I'm going to be giving you guys my thoughts and opinions. I would love to hear yours, though, in the comment section down below. So let's get into it. So first of all, guys... Project 007, this title doesn't have a release date as of yet. We are still waiting for confirmation on when this title is going to come out. Um, obviously, it's codenamed Project 007. I don't know if that's going to be the title, or obviously it says on their site that it's the working title, so most likely it'll be called something else. That being said, though, let's talk about this. At number one for me is definitely having a full package, that being multiplayer, co-op, as well as a single-player story. All three of those things are going to be massive, I believe, for the success of this title, simply because, obviously, you want to go back in time and you want to play those multiplayer elements, you know, playing uh, against your friends in split-screen on, on GoldenEye or whatever the case might be. You want to bring that energy back to this to, to this franchise, and I definitely believe that it's going to be a full package, that being a multiplayer, hopefully a really awesome single-player story as well. So after you're done playing the single-player story, you can, of course, play multiplayer, you can play co-op modes, and you're not necessarily just going to move on to other games if you have that full package. So I'm really, really excited about that. I, I'm hoping that we get a full package. I think we'll at least get a story as well as multiplayer. Uh, co-op modes would obviously be a huge bonus at the end of the day. At number two for me, guys, obviously what's really important about, you know, Project 007 to me is, is that you still stick to the roots of James Bond and what made it so special, but you also change it up a little bit, right? You want there to be something that makes it stand out from the older, you know, James Bond titles. So, and I definitely think IO Interactive is going to do this, where there's going to be differences as well as those similarities. That leads me to number three, guys, which is free-to-play elements. I would love to see the multiplayer of Project 007 and be free to play so that everyone will at least try it and that will help really start building the fan base around around the multiplayer and it may get people to buy the single player story or the co-op modes whatever the case might be because the multiplayer is free to play it justifies it and I think that free to play it would be so huge for this title, guys, without a doubt. I think it would be a massive ordeal. I'm not saying the whole title being free-to-play, but free-to-play elements, I think, could be absolutely huge. At number four for me, guys, I would love to see, you know, obviously, uh, Daniel Craig plays James Bond right now. I would love to see different iterations of James Bond over time that you can choose from. I would love to see a lot of customization features and things of that nature that you're able to customize your character, you're able to create your own character, or play one of the many James Bond, uh, you know, characters from the past in the movies and things of that nature. I think that would be absolutely awesome. Having a lot of customization features um, would be would be awesome to make it kind of stand out, right? Where everyone is, you know, trying to earn and get unlockable items and, and such throughout the gameplay, where you play the campaign and that those stats transfer over to the multiplayer, multiplayer over to co-op, so on and so forth. It's kind of one ecosystem I think would be absolutely awesome. And coming in, guys, at number five for me, I, I think it's really important, and we kind of alluded to this, but I think something that a lot of titles nowadays are are doing is they're copying one another, right? When you talk about a first-person shooter, a lot of these first-person shooter titles try to copy what's working, right, at that time, right? You look at games like Call of Duty Warzone. Is, is They're obviously doing something right. A lot of people are copying them. Fortnite really started this Battle Royale movement, and... You've got a lot of titles that are trying to copy and try to build off of what Fortnite did to build that success. I really want 
Project 007. Sure, it can take little things here and there, but I want it to be its own thing, its own entity completely. Because I can always just play Call of Duty Warzone. I can play, you know, these other titles. I want this to feel different, though. I want it to be itself, where it's its own thing. Like I said, maybe taking things from old, the James, old James Bond titles, but also taking things that, you know, can really help innovate this franchise moving forward and really set up the next generation of of James Bond titles, because I'm hoping that they this isn't the only one we get. I hope this is going to be a long withstanding franchise moving forward. But those are the things that I want to see out of Project 007. What do you guys want to see out of it? Let me know in the comment section down below and let's have a real conversation about it. And for more Project 007 content and videos, stay here with Zero TV.